Okay, we're ready to install Bellevue. So we want to start up the WordPress dashboard and we're going to go to Appearance and Themes. And then at the very top, we're going to choose Add New. And then we're going to choose the Upload feature. So we're going to upload the theme using this button. And then we're going to choose our file. Now hopefully you've downloaded the Bellevue.zip uh, file. Once you extract that, you'll see these other folders and other zip files are inside of that. So what you want to look for is the Bellevue-theme.zip. And we're going to select that and choose Open. And then we're going to choose Install Now. WordPress will install the theme and it'll give you an option to uh, live preview or activate. You want to choose the activate link and it's been successfully installed and now our next step is theme activation. So uh, Bellevue has um, prompted you to let you know that there are some plugins that are required to run Bellevue and some recommended plugins. We uh, re recommend that you install all of them for uh, all of the features to work and uh, for you to have a, a, a much easier time using the theme. So let's go ahead and install and activate these plugins. Okay, so we're going to click on the install and activate underneath the plugins header. The fastest way to do this is to check this checkbox at the top for bulk actions. And from the bulk actions drop down, we're going to choose install. And then we're going to click on apply. WordPress will install all of the themes, or sorry, all of the plugins that come with the theme. Some of them are bundled, and some of them it'll go and retrieve those uh, plugins through the uh, on the WordPress.org uh, uh, repository. Um, now we can go back to back to theme activation, and the second step is uh, to activate the plugin. So we're going to click on Install and Activate again, and here are all of our plugins that we've installed. So we want to choose the checkbox at the top for bulk actions, and we're going to activate all of these plugins. Choose apply, and that's it. Back to theme activation. And you can see here step one is completed. We're going to move on to importing demo content. Importing demo content is, is important. It'll help get you set up with the theme quickly. Um, and we recommend it. You don't have to, but it does make um, navigating around Bellevue a lot easier. So let's get started by importing the demo content and clicking on the import demo content link. And then we're going to choose our file. Uh, it, is in, it is included in the theme zip, so I'll show you where that is. If you have extracted your Bellevue.zip, you should see these folders here and also the two um, Bellevue theme zips. We're going to look under demo content and we're going to choose the Bellevue demo content.xml file. Once we have that selected, let's choose open. And we're going to click upload and upload file and import. This is going to give us an option to import underneath an author. And uh, if you've created your WordPress website, you probably have a default author. Let's just go ahead and select that. For mine, it's Bellevue. For yours, it might be something different. And we're going to make sure that this option is checked, download and import file attachments. What's that's, what that's going to do is it's going to bring over the placeholder images that we've created to help uh, make it easier for you to replace those images with real images. We're going to click on submit. And depending on your internet speeds and your hosting provider, uh, you might wait um, up to a minute for this install to take place. Uh, and uh, so yeah, just be patient. It will come back. And uh, once it comes back, it'll, it'll, it'll prompt you with a message. And here it is. Import WordPress has been completed. All done. Have fun. We want to actually check, uh, click on this link at the top back to theme activation because we're not completed yet. So there, the demo content has been imported. Now we want to move on to importing widget content and importing forms. Okay, we're ready to import the widget content. Let's click on this link. And uh, it's going to ask you to choose your file. We're going to go and find that file. It's uh, a WIE file. So underneath the uh, submission, or sorry, not the submission folder, the theme zip extraction folder, uh, we were went to demo content. And inside that demo content, you will find the Bellevue demo widget content.wie. And we're going to click on that and open that file. 
and then we're going to choose import widgets and that's imported the widgets successfully we're going to go back to theme activation and we're going to complete our final step of the demo content which is to import the forms so we're going to click on import forms and we're going to choose our file and inside that demo content folder you'll find bellevue formidable custom forms.xml we're going to choose that and open and we're going to click on the upload file and import button and then once those have been imported we're going to go back to theme activation and step two has been completed we've imported our demo content we're going to move on to step three which is to uh, set the static front page and some other options that I'll explain next okay we're on step three uh, set a static front page let's choose the home page we do want a static front page unless you want your blog posts to be on the home page, the default home page. Most, uh, most people would want the home page to be the static front page, so I've selected that. Uh, we want to leave the rest of these options selected to yes. Uh, if you know what you're doing, sure you can go through and change these custom or uh, default options, but I recommend just leaving these all to yes and click on the save changes button. And once that's complete, it'll take you back to the themes um, page where you can see Bellevue has been installed. And from here, you can actually go on to view your site. And you'll see here that Bellevue has been successfully installed. The demo content has been successfully imported. And uh, there are placeholder images here for the uh, content. Um, these are just to help you locate and find the spaces where you want to add your own images. The demo content is all there. And you can see here that all of these pages are now imported into your site. Next, you might want to watch our video on how to add and edit content back at uh, our website, bellevuetheme.com. Thank you.